Welcome to Advent Day Reflections, I'm Father Jonas John Peary. Today, Saturday of the first week of Advent, we are going to reflect on the gift of salvation. Our passage is from Matthew chapter 10, verses 5 to 15. Without cost you have received, without cost you are to give. What is it that we have received without a cost? Well, we have received every good thing for free. It is, it is true, uh, all that is good is a gift from God and it is a free gift from Him. There is nothing we can do to earn his blessings in our lives. The scripture passage that we have quoted is part of Jesus' exhortation to his 12 apostles as he sends them out to preach, heal, and cast out demons in his name. He reminds them that all they have received from him is a free gift and that they must in turn Give the gospel free of charge to everyone. Advent is a time when we should especially focus upon the coming celebration of the gift of Christmas. Christmas is a time when we give and receive gifts, but it is important to understand the difference between a gift and a present. A present is something that is expected. For example, your spouse, or a child or a friend expects a present on their birthday or on Christmas. But a gift is something that is much more. A gift is something that is freely given and earned and undeserved. It is given out of love with no strings attached. This is what uh, the incarnation is all about. This is what the coming to earth of the Son of God is all about. Advent must be a time when we ponder on the truth that God came to earth to give us himself in an unmerited and a f in, in a free way. His life is a totally free gift to us and is the greatest gift we have ever received. In turn, Advent must be a time when we also reflect on our calling to bring the gift of Christ Jesus to others. Today, let us reflect on the giving and the receiving of Jesus in our life. Let our heart be filled with gratitude this Advent so that I in turn can give the gift of Jesus to others. Let us pray. Lord, thank you for the gift of your life. Thank you for coming to earth to enter into my life. Thank you for the joy of knowing you and loving you. May I allow this joy to so transform my life that I may continually seek to give you to others who lives and reigns with the Father and the Spirit forever and ever. Till next time, may God bless you. Christ